What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Well, today is the day that I am going to roll Uber Eats until the, uh, I guess we could say the wheels fall off. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go uh, Uber Eats 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. and kind of see what is going on with Uber Eats. Um, when I do it sparingly, like when I do Uber Eats, when I'm not doing Grubhub, I've always used Uber Eats as like a space filler in between Grubhub stuff or whatever, you know. Um, I've noticed the last several months, you know, here and there when I do Uber Eats, I've noticed the payouts being awesome. I've noticed the payouts rivaling Grubhub at times. So I am gonna just roll Uber Eats all day um, and uh, see what kind of money I can make out here on Uber Eats. Now I know back some years ago, Uber Eats was always like the super duper low ball. But um, like I said, it seems like lately Uber Eats has been coming up. So we're gonna roll it, like I said, 10 a.m. right now to 10 p.m. It's a long day. It's gonna be long, it's gonna be grueling. Don't know how it's gonna turn out. I can only hope for the best. And um, we're gonna see in this little experiment how much I can make on Uber Eats at the end of the day. And well, you know, after 10 p.m. or until they kick me off or whatever it is. All right, talk to you soon. Also, I forgot to mention that, yes, of course, you know, there's gonna be times where I'm gonna to have to stop for a few minutes here and there to maybe get something to eat. Uh, something to drink or just use the bathroom, but I'm gonna try to keep that stuff down to a bare minimum You know if I need to get something to eat I'm gonna get something quick and eat it real fast or to drink to, oh, to Take it with me in the car uh, But I'm gonna try to make sure all of my time is maximized on the app and Not wasted doing some other things. So that's also what I forgot to, to add Boom! First delivery, Habit Burger for $18.12. First I thought, what is this, like two orders? Um, but no, it was one order. And uh, the payout is pretty darn sweet, so that is not a bad start to my 12-hour day. So I just had an $11.12 add-on. Uh, for Mr. Pickle Sandwich Shop, which isn't too far from here, and it is basically going to the same city where I'm dropping off this Habit Burger. So, boom, once again, um, very very short distance, maybe about, I, I think it was like six miles. So, let's do it. And for anybody's further information, this Habit Burger order that I'm getting paid 18 and some change for, it's labeled as a Postmates order. So, there you go. Got the Habit Burger in tow for that Postmates order. Now we're gonna go on to the add-on, which was Mr. Pickle's Sandwich Shop, which isn't too far from here. So let's uh, go make this cheddar today. In 1,000 feet, use the right two lanes to turn right onto the California 92 ramp to Half Moon Bay. Now I got this Mr. Pickle's order ready to roll. So Head let's to your go. Job at 15. Let's go do this, make this money. So I just got those two delivered and now I got another double delivery. Uh, the offer is $27.95. It is at Sweet Green, which isn't too far from here. It is pretty quick. And the drop off looks like, oh, the drop offs will be in that general In area also. Mile, so let's do it. So the beauty of these pickups is they were all at the same restaurant. So 27, almost 28, and 27 some change, almost 28. Let's do this. Man, look at these friggin' houses down here. This is insane. Damn, I have got those orders dropped off. I just got another double order for Sweet Green again for $24.55. I tell you what, if these stacked orders are gonna pay out like they are today, as well as they are for short distance, 
You bet your ass. I will keep taking these stacked orders if the money's right. First apartment delivery of the day. Contactless delivery done. Now let's get on to the next drop off. Damn, I'm making some money today. This is gotta be damn near a record on Uber Eats or on any app so far with these stacked ass orders. But like I said, I will take these stacked orders, not a problem. Which one will it be? Ha! Here we go. So far, just a shade under three hours, and I am already at $86.90. This is that has not been a very bad little lunch. This has actually been pretty good. Most of these orders were stacked. Uh, 856, or I'm sorry, 886. Yeah, I'll take that. So so far, that was seven Continue orders. Pick up at Mr. Pickle Sandwich Shop, San Mateo. I am now on order number eight. Take right exit so I'll check in with you guys later. Hello. 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 And I picked up this Mr. Pickle's order. It was ready when I got here. It's not bad. I'll be like at what, 92 something, 93 dollars when this one's completed. And I'm about at the three hour mark right now. On top of which. I'm parked right next to McDonald's, but as you can see, construction zone. So I guess I won't be getting any McDonald's orders tonight. <laughs> mile, make a right turn on California. Just picked up a uh, subway order for $13.84, and it's going about five miles away. So let's do this. Keep making the money today. These got to be the best payouts on Uber Eats I have probably ever seen. This is just insane, but a good day and a profitable day. Kind of funny. I wonder if there's a catch to it somewhere. Everything's going too good. It is now 2.14 p.m. and after that last subway delivery, I'm at 105.34, but I know the subway order that I just dropped off, um, there's gonna, probably gonna be a tip that's gonna come in on that one, so that's gonna make me even higher. And I got some other tips I don't think have come in yet either. So far, so good, man. Um, you know, over 100 bucks for lunch. This is, like I said before, this is like unheard of. This is the way Grubhub used to be, you know. I got, but I got lucky then with a lot of stacked orders today too. Um, but this ain't bad, you know. And like I said, a couple. One of them was a Postmates. There was another Postmates one that I I forgot to disclose. One of the other Mr. Pickles orders that were, you know, that was well over ten dollars. So, you know, them Postmates orders were always notoriously low, but. The last few that I've received on the Uber Eats app here, you know, on Uber Eats now, it's been pretty decent. Just got a Starbucks order for uh, $6.87. A little low, but it's gonna be a short distance trip. And so far for me, these Starbucks orders have been just easy, have been a, a pleasure to do, because they're always ready when you get there. Starbucks is on top of it. So a little low on the pace, but short distance delivery trip. Um, and it's Starbucks, so I mean, they've been pretty good to me so far. So I'll take this one. So I just got a $7.09 add-on to that from the same Starbucks. So I'm gonna grab that too and uh, we'll get on our way. It is now 3.30. I've taken a little break to go use the restroom at uh, one of the grocery stores and I bought myself a Cliff Bar and a cold brew coffee here. Get a little something in my gut, get me a little energized. So it's 3.30 right now, taking a little break. Um, so I'm gonna go till about 10 p.m. tonight. And we'll see at the end what I've earned. I'm at a, I'm at a little 130 and some change right now. For lunch, that is not bad. Not bad at all. And um, I'll check in with you guys a little later. 
So it's about 4.39. Uh, it's been a little while since I checked in. Um, ended up calling my mom and then calling my dad after I talked to my mom, I talked to my dad, checking in with them. Um, and then I, I ate that little snack and um, things got kind of slow on old Uber Eats. So where I was before, I repositioned myself and then I went back online and still nothing. So it's about 4.39. I would expect, <clears throat> excuse me, things will start picking up at about five, hopefully. Um, but yeah, I got some more tips rolling and I'm at 139.33. That was lunch. So let's see what dinner will bring. Well, dinner time is upon us now. It is now 5.04 p.m. I got a uh, order for Pancho Villa Taqueria. It's, gonna, it's about a three mile trip, so Let's go. So we're gonna pick up this order at Pancho Villa and look what I found on the ground. One dollar. Looks like um, this might be my lucky night. <laughs> Let's hope the tips aren't just one dollar, but it's a good sign, right? So that got done and I've now got a double um, for about $19.50 right now that I'm heading to. I already picked up one of the orders. Now I'm just going to George Lopez Tacos. I didn't know there was a George Lopez Tacos, but I'm gonna go there to get the second order and then I'll be on my way and then I'll be getting my $19.50 roughly, I do believe. So let's do it. You guys wanna see the George Lopez Tacos place? Odd, talk about odd area to pick up, but we'll check it out. Please go around back. All right. Go around back, but what the hell? There is no way to go around back. What? Yeah, I gotta drive around. I mean, this is some bullshit. Make a right turn on 9th Avenue, then make a right it turn brought me to the, the wrong street. side. Now I gotta go around to 9th Avenue, go around into the other side in the back. Am I going back here? Make a right turn on South Idaho Street. Yes, I might have to cut this one loose. I don't got time to play this game. I don't got time for this, guys, for real. Because I got smoothies. This first order is some smoothies. Make a right turn on 7th Avenue. Is this the back side of it? Yeah. Well, they need to make it a little bit more clear than that, not just when you get here and you basically read on the window that you got to go around. That is some BS. That was a real odd pickup. It was like a warehouse. It's like it was like right next to a mechanic shop and it was like another like warehouse kind of kitchen place where it's just a big warehouse converted into a gigantic kitchen and it was George Lopez Tacos and it might have been a couple other restaurants in there too um, but it was all just to go junk you know of course it was a it was a warehouse but that was another odd pickup and it's a hotel delivery awesome That was a little over a ten dollar uh, trip. They uh, also tipped me cash, so that's two three bucks. So Uber just tried to send me like fairly deep San Francisco for a drop off. It was going to be picked up out here, and then it was going to Paris Street in San Francisco, which is a little too deep into San Francisco for my taste. So uh, that eleven dollars or whatever it was. Yeah, it wasn't worth it. And right now, after those this delivery I just delivered, um, I'm at 150.15, and it's only about a little after 6 p.m. So, still out here. It is about 8:46 p.m. Um, dinner. Since the last time I talked to you, dinner got kind of slow for a little while, but now it's kind of starting to move again. Um, I'm at Taco Bell. I'm going to pick up this order for $13.46. And um, and where am I at right now? I am at $174.37. $174.37 right now. Which I don't think is a whole hell of a lot bad. I was hoping for a little bit more by now. But like I said, things kind of took a dive a little while ago for just a little while, an hour or so. And now things are moving again. So we'll see. Well, end of the night. Um, 
not as much as I thought I was going to do because uh, today started off so promising. Um, I am at the end of the grand total of 182.86. Uh, there's still some more tips to come in. Um, lunch was lunch was jamming. Lunch was pretty consistent. Dinner not so much. Dinner started off kind of good and got good in some spots, but then it would it would kind of fall off and and chill for a while, and then pick back up and then fall back down and pick back up and fall back. So dinner wasn't so profitable, but lunch was was jamming. Lunch was moving. It was, it kept me busy. Uh, but right now, uh, like I said, there's still some tips to come in, but I'm at 182.86. And that's going to be it for this video. Thank you all so much for joining me on this day that we are um, we did together. Um, like I said, I was hoping for a better result. But the evening was so beautiful and so nice. I'm willing to bet that people just went out and got their own dinner tonight because it was such a nice evening. Anyway, guys, I'll talk to you soon. Peace out.